There's nothing to hide. Sleep. Oh, huh. that's a good idea. I think these are her favorite. Oh, oh. Uh, good morning. Oh, uh, good morning, Buttercup. How was your sleep? Decent. None <laughs> of the kids woke up. Good, good. <gasps> what? Good morning. <laughs> hey. hey. Do you have a shh? <laughs> Fine. Good morning, Doctor. Uh, uh, look what I did. Oh my goodness. How did you make these? You know these are our favorites. I I want to do something special for the kids, and I know you're they're your favorites, so uh <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> no problem, man. No problem at all. Something smells good. Good morning, Rachie. Yes. <gasps> Yum! But I kind of want to wait for my friends. Okay, you can play. Thank you. Ooh. Glasses. Caitlin, are you up? I didn't sleep. I mean, who would in this? Hi, Maddie. Wake up. Was that a bad dream? Nope. Oh. The babies. Wait. Where's Rachie? <gasps> She's already up! We need to tell her what's going on. But. Have a phone? Nope. Hi. No, this is a lilac's phone. Oh, she's gonna kill you. Oh no, she's not. Maybe we don't even have to go along with the plan. Or run away or anything like that. We could just Crystal. <laughs> Good morning, girls. <laughs> morning, Buttercup. How are you? Good, just gotta get the babies. Come on, guys. 
I happen to watch the TV channels that none of you want to watch. Ew, the commercials? Gross! But they're not that bad. And I know for a fact, this kind of cheap phone that Lilac uses happens to record every call. Wait, so if you just show it to the doctor or Miss Sophia? Exactly. <laughs> I'll keep it in my bed. Now let's go downstairs. <laughs> Good morning, you three. Hi. Guess who made breakfast? Yay! <laughs> Sophia, can I talk to you? Uh oh, what happened? Oh, nothing, nothing happened, you know? Just a casual chat, right, dog, homie? <laughs> Sorry. Um, yeah. So, you know how me and Lilac and Caitlin have phone? The what? Lilac, come get breakfast. Fine. Excuse me. Oh. Are you okay, Caitlin? Oh, uh, yeah, I just fell over. <laughs> Do you ever wonder what these kids are really doing on their phones? I, I, I don't really care enough to. <laughs> Wait, Lilac, I don't even know about her phone, really. But you guys wouldn't do anything bad. Don't you think maybe we should start checking these phones? What? Why would we do such a thing? Just to be safe, you know, make sure no creeps get in here because I'd hate to ruin this beautiful orphanage. Oh, Crystal, I appreciate the concern, but there is absolutely no need to do that. I don't really have the time or patience, and honestly, if something really bad did happen, I'm pretty sure the police would have been called. The stuff that goes on here is so bad, I'm surprised the FBI honestly hasn't showed up. But thank you, Crystal. You can have your breakfast now, dear. I made your favorite. Oh, uh, thanks, Miss Sophia. We have to do it. I know. There's no way she'll check our phones. And we don't even know her password. So it's useless? Yeah. Ahem, <laughs> out of my way. My favorite show. Perfect. You gonna eat, Caitlin? Oh, uh, no thank you. You know, these are so good, you actually have to try them. Uh, no thank you. I, I think I'm good. Okay, see you yourself. <laughs> Lily, can you come here? Uh, yeah. What's wrong, sweetie? You see a bit jittery and nervous? You just seem anxious. Are you panicking? Uh, no, I'm fine. I'm just cold. Uh, okay. <laughs> we all have to go upstairs. Yeah, come on. Where are you all going? Just upstairs, and I can take the babies for you, Buttercup. Don't you want me to watch them so you have other things to do? I, I did want to make some phone calls. Yes, Crystal, that'd be lovely. Uh, okay, come on. Come on, guys. Richie, we need you upstairs. Uh, uh, okay. Guys, you're scaring me a little. What's wrong? This is serious, Richie. Very serious. Last night, Richie, we heard horrible things. Like what? Lilac's not an orphan. What do you mean? She was calling her mom on the phone and said that her plan is to make sure we never get adopted and this place suffers. What? Guys, we have to run away. What? But I love it here. I'll look after you. We'll be safe together. I promise I won't let anything happen to you. I swear. <laughs> It'll be okay. We're gonna leave tonight and never look back. But what?
what about Miss Sophia and Dr. Dan and Buttercup? We're gonna have to leave them, and I don't want to, but we have to. We're gonna start a better life on our own, even if it's gonna be hard and cold. It'll be much better than living in the dark all sad. Dog. But when will we come back? Yeah, next week? Never. <sighs> come on. And we're gonna take the babies. You can't look after them. Yes, we can. We'll do it together. I'm gonna take this small bag. We can each put like one thing in here. Pack something important. I had this since I was a baby. I'm gonna pack it. Uh, I'm gonna take my dress. But they've been taking care of us forever. I don't wanna leave them, but we have to be smart and strong. I'll give my life for you. Here, I'm also gonna take my phone. Okay. Can I take this? Yeah. I'm gonna go get a cup from downstairs. We're gonna need it. Food. Crystal, dear, what are you doing? Oh, uh, hey, Miss Sophia. <laughs> you all seem nervous. I'm worried. There's nothing to worry about, Miss Sophia. I hope you know your favorite TV show's on tomorrow. Oh, that's great. Oh, Miss Sophia. <laughs> What's wrong, Crystal? I just want to say you're the best and I really love you. Please don't forget that. It's nothing personal. What? Uh, sorry. Can I just take this water cup upstairs? Lila, I mean, Lily really wants some water. Sure. Just don't spill it. Don't spill what? Dr. Dan. Uh, what? Thank you for basically being my dad. Uh, what? And my best friend Buttercup. What is with her? I don't know. I wanted to take more toys. That's all we can fit. We'll get through this. We'll be the runaway orphans. But that sounds terrible. I just want to stay here. But we can't. Tonight. Let's go downstairs. Okay. What is with that? Come on, guys, let's play. Caitlin. Yeah? I am not going to move until I stand here and watch you eat this. Uh, eat this? Yeah, Caitlin. I've barely seen you eat a thing since you arrived here. And that's been, what, three, four days? I'm just not feeling well, okay? You still need to eat. Crystal, what's wrong? Nothing's wrong, you don't have to worry. Okay. Dear Diary, my name is Crystal Richardson, and I am 15 years old, and I'm an orphan. I've been an orphan my whole life, basically. I was two when I first came here. I live at Wigley Orphanage. And it's the most beautiful place ever. Life here was almost perfect. And if one thing would just simply change, I'd stay here forever. Tonight, me and my friends will be running away. I know it sounds awful, but I don't think you truly understand. Rylock? She's been here forever. She's rude and heartless and a bully. But we found out more that her plan is to ruin us, even more than she already has. So we have to run away. I really hate to leave this place as much as the other kids do, but I, we need to protect ourselves. The only pain is gonna be leaving and leaving the free amazing workers. So just in case things go wrong, I just need to remember them and tell you. I'll keep updating forever, as long as I can.